the topic of this video is uh, basic commutation relationships if you take a one dimensional system its state function can be expressed as uh, psi of x in position space the position operator can be taken as x hat and the position operator as p hat which is equal to minus i h cut into 2 by 2 x the commutator of uh, x hat and p x hat is uh, written as a square bracket like this and it is equal to x p x minus uh, p x into x and if this commutator operates on, its, on the state function psi of x, we can write the psi of x for individual terms like this. And if you use the fact that px is this partial differentiation operator, we can get uh, this expression. And if you do that uh, differentiation for these uh, uh, x into psi of x, which we can consider as a uv product and then uh, we can put this uh, x hat constant and then do the derivation for psi and in the next step uh, when we kept uh, psi of x constant and did the, the differentiation of uh, x hat with respect to x we can write that as uh, identity operator i and here these two terms the first two terms will get cancelled and we are left with uh, i h cut i into psi of x if you remove uh, psi of x on both sides, we can write the uh, commutator of x and px is equal to i h cut into i. If we had considered a three dimensional uh, wave function, we could have had even these relationships between y p y and uh, z p z resulting in i h cut into i. If you take any combination of the position operators x hat, y hat and z hat and their commutators will all be equal to zero. Similar is the result even for uh, p hat, uh, p x hat, p y hat, and p z hat. And all these uh, uh, commutator relationships are called the basic commutator relationships. That's it in this video, and thanks for watching.